Good morning, everyone. This is Ida with Creative to Create. Uh, welcome back to my channel. I have a uh, project share, but I'm not going to do that right now. But I do have one for you. Um, I have a small collective haul, and it's not very big. Well, eh, it's a medium one. But I've ordered it a while back, and I finally uh, got it, some of it in. Anyway, one of the things that I picked up, this one is from Amazon. And I picked up this uh, Linda Canassi. I think it's Canassi tag. And uh, what I like about this tag, it looks like it cuts out the, sli the, the little slits in the corner. So you can insert another image in the tag or... Um, or a photo. I haven't even tried it out, guys. I haven't had a chance to really play with it. Uh, some of you know that my mother's very ill, and my mother has been in the hospital right now for a couple of weeks now. So whenever I really do have uh, downtime, uh, I go to see my mother. So uh, that's why um, I haven't really been able to play too much. And uh, But when I saw this, uh, I actually picked this up before my mother was even uh, ill, and I hadn't had a chance to share it with you. But I love the December 25th here. The Don't Peek. Open Me First. Best gift ever. And then I love the fact that this has the slits. Or I think it does. I haven't played with it yet. But that's what it looks like. So that's one of the ones that I bought. Uh, and it does have the dies for the holly right here. It has the die for the little candle. It has the die for the bell. And then it has the die for the bow. Uh, and it's got a poinsettia die that you don't see a stamped image here, but it does have a little poinsettia and then this tag right here. I wish it would have had one for the December 25th, but it doesn't. Uh, I will link this in the description box. This came from Amazon and I'm dying to play with it. As soon as I get a chance, I will. Um, so that came from Amazon. That's the only thing I have to share with you uh, from Amazon, I think, because I'm waiting on stuff. Um, and then I got in my my um, my little haul from Allie, and uh, these are designed by Nicole Silhouette. And I wish I had had these when I did the collaboration, because I did, they really didn't have anything that was baking themed, and that's what I did for the collaboration. Um, so after that, I did order these, and they finally it took forever, but they finally did come in. Uh, so I ordered the bowls, and I, I'm going to give you a visual. See, the largest one fits in the palm of my hand. I think sometimes uh, when we share these, I thought they were larger. But now that I see them, it, the largest one is not very big. It's a perfect size for a tag or an embellishment, a card front, something like that. And then it's got these layering pieces that go on the edge, kind of to trim the rim of the bowl. And then it does come with a butterfly and the body to the butterfly, a heart and a star. So that's one that I picked up from, from uh, Miss Nicole. Here's another measuring scoops. Again, the biggest one fits in the palm of my hand, so you know it's not very big. And it, it's a three-piece set, so there's a smaller one, and then the biggest one, and then a tiny one. So I picked those up and then these cups I have seen uh, some people design with these and I thought they were really large but there again guys both cups fit in my hand and the spoon so it lets you know that they're not very large they're the perfect size and these do come with a la layering piece where you can layer or turn it into a shaker so I picked that up I picked up the measuring uh, spoons, and again, I thought these were really, really large, but there they are in the palm of my hand. So they're not very large at all. So I picked those up. You can do shakers or uh, layering pieces. And then I picked up the rolling pins, and these always look extremely large. But there it is, guys. The whole thing fits in the palm of my hand. So the largest one here might be about three and a half inches is what I'm thinking. And then this one maybe two and a half, and then the tiny one might be two inches. So they're not very big, perfect for embellishments. I also picked up this candy jar. This is a, a little bit bigger, and I love it. And it, this fits completely. It takes up my whole hand. So this is a good size. It does come with a layering piece and other bits and pieces. So that's a good one. And then, of course, guys, I had to get the mixers. And I bought um, I bought both sizes. She has the smaller one. This is the smaller one. And then she has a larger one. Um, 
these you can turn them into a shaker because they come with this solid piece right here for the bowl and then it comes with the layering piece right here that can you can layer or you can um, turn into a shaker but there it is it's on the palm of my hand so that's a very nice uh, embellishment size and but the the large one is really large so see this one is pretty big it's like from the bottom from my wrist almost to the tip of my fingers so this one's really really large i'm going to say this is probably about four inches uh, maybe even closer to four and a half and it does come with the layering piece to turn it into a shaker and all the little bits and pieces to uh, for your KitchenAid mixer so i picked that up and then one more thing i picked up from ali are these uh, dies and they do come with uh, the little uh, die to cut stamps, I'm sorry. And it comes with a little tag die to cut these out. So I really like these. I thought I had these and I went hunting for them and I didn't have them. So I picked those up. That's all I picked up from Allie. So I'm going to remove these and then share with you what I picked up from Tuesday morning. I uh, Like I said, I went to see my mother yesterday and uh, of course I had to take a trip to to um to Tuesday morning because I've been watching a lot of you ladies haul that bag. Oh, I so want that from Crafter's Companion. I didn't find it, but I did find some other things. So I picked up some of this bling uh flatback pearls. They're $1.99 from Tuesday morning. And the reason I picked these up, uh, I don't have all the swaps in yet for the for the Secret Santa, and if I have to step in, then I have to be ready. So I love, love uh, the cream colored uh, flat back pearls. So that definitely would be one of my favorites for crafting. So I picked those up for that. And then I picked up this beautiful die from Crafter's Companion. Um, it's very pretty. It comes with the intricate piece, and then it does come with the silhouette. Let me turn it to the back. See right here? It does come with the intricate piece and then the silhouette. So I'm dying to try that. I would have loved to have picked up more, but they only had the one because that would have been a great um, favorite item to put in the packages. But again, I was looking for the, the handbag that everybody's hauling, but I, I wasn't able to find it. And then I picked this one up. This is a Christmas panel as well. So it's got the hollies and poinsettias and looks like maybe candy canes or something that looks like candy canes. And it does come with uh, the silhouette and the, the intricate piece. And there's what it looks like right there. So, and they only had one, so I picked it up. And then I picked up this uh, uh, stamp. And this is those rubber stamps that are very thick by spellbinders this was for 29 and it says i could fall for you so it's an autumn or a fall themed uh stamp and it's got the acorns and i really like this so they had one and i picked it up uh, my my um tuesday morning or my closest one is like an hour away but it has a very small uh craft area it's not very big and then I found this one because at some point I want to do a sewing theme uh, swap or, or just create Happy Mail. And this one says, may, may your bobbin always be full. And it's got the, the bobbin right here with the hearts going around it, $3.99. I thought that was a good deal. Definitely pretty. And then I picked up a couple of packs of these uh, poinsettias. These are very similar to the ones that we get at Hobby Lobby. Um... So I really like these, and I said, well, I'm just going to pick them up. Uh, $2.49, I probably could have got them at Hobby Lobby for that price on sale, because I think they have a sale, but I wasn't going that way, so I picked these up there. And then they had these awesome stickers by American Craft. Look at these foil stickers. Look at that. And these are a double-sided pack. Let me turn it around and share with you the other side. There is the other side. And I thought these were really, really nice. And they're puffy. They're dimensional. They're not a flat. They're a puffy sticker. They're thickers. And these were $2.99. Uh, I normally don't buy stickers, but I felt these were really pretty to add to tags and to cards. So they're all the same. I picked up three packages of these because if I have to, like I said, 
step in for the um, for the Secret Santa. I'll have a few things that at least match that I can share. Um, so that's all that I picked up. Like I said, I do have a project share, but uh, maybe later. Thanks for watching. I hope everyone is having a great day. I will link the purchase that I made on Amazon and uh, the other stuff, you guys, I'm not going to do anything. Uh, you know, I can't really do anything about the rest. You'll just have to go there and look for it. You saw what I hauled and, and I gave you the information of where to buy it. So it shouldn't be too difficult. Thanks for watching. Everyone have a great day and God bless. Bye.